what he likes to do. Looks like he'll be able to do that this time as he gets going and gets out of lane. Could see Starhorn in this one behind one to zero, of course, against Royal Club. Uh, well, we're in the calm before the storm, mid lane for the team. See what you can provide with this set. Once again, laps mid off time to do it at level one. This time it happened a little later. Like this move from EDG, the whoa, flash hook from SCZF forces the flash out of zero, and they went. Dragon and keep the gold close. And they're gonna take the around the map now, calling it for insect. This is where they, they have to die. play the ping game. Shots coming in, Name six, does he have enough mana? Uses for relentless pursuit. He has the calling still to come out on this one, but they're able to finalize the kill on the cola. Pulling up first blood there. It's the exhaust coming out as well, but a double kill in for Unstoppable. That's you in the mid lane, and they get exactly what they want. We're only eight and a half minutes in. Hey, you hasn't played Zed much, but when he does, he goes 2-0 at the start of the game. That was for that pick that's after his colors and that Brutalizer is also spreading his items wow. to the rest of Royal Club. But now they are going to try and get towards Nama. There is the Dark Passage to get him off to safety. The Q does land though. Insect tries to get behind him. He kicks hey. Nama, but against the wall. There's also the hook coming in. Miwan Koro has teleported down and Royal Club just like that are on the back foot. Koro got the speed here from his ultimate running, but with Oriana there, it might be too dangerous to keep going. Cola though off to the side, force the flash. There's the shockwave. They're going to maybe turn this one around. Zed diving in as well. Cole is gonna go low. Will he be finished? Yes, he will. Killing three now for you. That's gonna be the chase. No, no, they're gonna stop. Good dissonance, but very low mana. Corn and Uzi are actually still trying to taste this. That means Uzi gets caught. He tries to jump in for the kill. That's not gonna be what he wanted. More kills coming up for Uzi. Oh, Picks that up onto Cordo. That no dissonance to follow, but they are gonna be able to lock down the quadra kill for Uzi. What aggression! 700 gold difference between junglers, and it's all on Uzi to make a play. Oh dear. This could be bad. Definitely gonna mean Uzi has to rush a Quicksilver Sash throughout this game. Yu's gonna be able to get himself out. Uzi stays alive with the help of two shields. Oh. That's the pop-up from Monsoon. Trying to hit it! Insect locked it down! Sonic Wave, the resonating strike, and another kill for him. That's a shot as well. A little bit of trade in gold here. Nice breathing room given by the calling, but it is not enough. The disengage, Zero loving those champions. He's able to throw out the monster. Here they go! No, they flashed in for this one! White on the corn! He will not be getting out alive. Not even close to Azania's yet. They trade one FCZF, but it is going to be out clear luck going down. Flash is being blown to continue the fight on. Name gets hit up. A double kill now for Uzi within this fight. He's six, right. zero, and two. Yeah. It's on the 20. Those heals been used. So many heals. Oh, oh my out. god. Is the oh no! Here comes Carl and FCZF. Well, they are going to be able to get the Baron, but will they be able to get out? Uzi goes down. They end up losing Cola. Insane will fall as well. They get Baron, but they lose three. Was that a replay from last game? It was close to. <laughs> Instead of, yeah. The now. Well, not, not instead of the Nami. Instead, oh, never mind. They're going for Yui. They're going to use that shockwave that they saved before. Yui's probably going to go down, but will he take home with him? He will. And then even flashing away. And I don't think Zero's even got the damage to finish that. Frequently there, they just ping the top and bottom waves because they know the other waves are shoving. And something has to happen shortly. They're definitely getting what they want out of it. They don't need any vision control around. Using this one as well quite easily. They have a great wave in the top lane. We talked about the wave at the oh, bottom. Really? There it is. Looking for clear love. Insect kick right away. Yu goes in, pulling back to his ultimate. And it looks like oh, he's going to stay alive. He lives in the oh monster just a little bit, but he's not out oh. of danger yet. Has to flash over the wall so he doesn't eat the calling. Slowing down Koro so he can't get around the outside with his ultimate Is as he well. Going for it? That would be a deadly, deadly what? thing to do. They give Uzi the movement speed. He's got a few more shields. So at this point, it's no longer about baiting Baron. It's Royal Club just starting it. They will peel the fight, I think, unless EDG decides to not go for it. Well, they're not going to go for it, or if they do, they're going to be very slow. They finally do start moving in, but Uzi, he's getting ready to move. He spotted FCZF. There's the speed up. He's going to go in for him. That's the slow. The Q lands from Insect. Where's the follow up? They're on top of him. There's the kick away from the team, funnily enough. That Q land is going to be Uzi to get another one. They try and blast him down from the side. There's the monsoon coming out. Uzi gets all the shields. In comes you. You will actually go down. It's an auto attack in the end and a double for Uzi. 
Insect still continues through as well. Name trying to escape, will blast down one, but not the other. And now it's all on Koro, left running away with zero on no HP. Oh. Takes him down. That's a big burst. Looks like Yuzi and Cola really want this final kill, and they'll get it for the ace. And at the end of the day, it's now a 10 0 Twitch, and another lead book will be pushing in their favor. Mid lane, Sandy Flem is going the other way. Equalizer comes down. Looks like he's just to force them off the tower. Not the best equalizer at the moment, but a pretty fed Twitch. Everyone runs. Whoa! It doesn't have to be the best equalizer when you got Uzi with shields on him going in. Both members now, Insect and Uzi, picking up a kill for themselves. Ooh. Clear loving Koro running for Solace on the fountain. That's pretty much all they got. Not even enough for home guards. So they're slowly refilling their health bars here. They're going to lose the inhibitor, and it doesn't look like they're going to stop. Royal Club with shields are going to start face tanking these turrets. The slow, so they can't get in. Uzi would be able to take them out anyways. Cola, got to be a little careful here. And they don't have any waves, so they might back, but it's Royal Club. Well, Uzi is somewhat fed at this point. They get one. Koro has to run away once again to heal up on the farm team. Uzi was tanking the Nexus turret there for a second. They need to get rid of that one and juggle the aggro. They finally do. Koro comes back in. He will fall to another kill for Uzi at 14 1 6. FTZF comes on through, but the Nexus goes down. And Royal Club move to game point. Wow. What a carry that time by Uzi and the rest of his team just supporting